So here are some use cases for Apple AirTags. Obviously, uh, you know, you can use this with a variety of things, but I wanted to give you a few hints on what you can possibly use this AirTag for. So some of the things that came to mind uh, is to actually track very young children or pets. Um, I think you can, you know, buy something like this. I picked this up for my, for my son, um, who happens to be one of those kids who likes to run around so I can simply you know, open this up uh, and, you know, slide this thing in. Bam. And then, you know, my son can wear it around his, his arms and, um, you know, I can, I can track him, right? So as a tracker, you can use it, obviously, um, with older kids, this is not going to work uh, because they might just take it off or something like that. But with very young children, um, this is a, 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 you know, a cool use case. You can obviously attach it to a pet, for instance, around their collar as well. Um, a lot of people do that. And also with dementia patients. So if you have some, you know, an older person um, in the family who is um, uh, affected by dementia, uh, it's, a, it's a nice use case, you know, to have an air tag around them. Uh, so in case they wander off, uh, you're able to, be, you know, find them, right? So um, I think it's a safety feature. Um, it's obviously not meant for snooping or doing anything legal like that, but, um, you know, in a family situation, uh, this can be a, a lifesaver. You also can obviously attach it to uh, objects such as backpack, purses, luggage. Uh, luggage happens to be one of those use cases where a lot of people use them. Uh, you can simply, you know, place this inside your luggage and then it becomes very convenient to find where your luggage is around the airport. And if it's in the carousel and as it approaches, you can track it, right? So that's that's one use case a lot of people use it for. Um, you can even uh, attach it to a bike. Um, you know, a lot of bikes get stolen in larger cities. Um, so if you have this attached to a bike, you can, you know, trace your bike very easily. Same thing applies for a, for a car or a boat. Um, in a lot of these kind of applications, if you are going to use this, uh, it's a good idea to actually you know, open this case, um, pop out the battery, and then remove the uh, speaker that's built in. There are other videos uh, on YouTube that show you how to do that. Uh, it's a very simple procedure, but uh, if you take out the speaker, now it becomes, uh, you know, goes on stealth mode, so to speak, right? Because it's not gonna play chimes or anything, and uh, the person who stole your boat, bike, car, whatever, won't know that uh, there's a air tag, you know, tracing them and you can you know, retrieve um, your, your asset. The next use case is tracking, obviously, keys. Um, you know, that happens to be a very common thing that people misplace. Uh, so having this as, as part of your keychain is a good idea. You can even place it uh, with a TV remote. Uh, so if you have that problem going on, there are cases available where you can you know, slide this in, very similar to what you saw here, uh, to trace your remote, or even the tools, right? So if you happen to um, have a lot of tools around and there are multiple people in the garage situation and this is a more expensive tool, it's not a bad idea to use an air tag uh, to locate where did your tool go, right? In case um, there is that possibility. So I thought those were some use cases that I find, I, I hope you find interesting. And uh, I'm sure, you know, people are cooking up uh, newer and newer ideas on how to use these air tags uh, with a variety of use cases. So if you have a cool idea, please uh, do comment down below and share it with others. So if you found this useful, please do subscribe to the channel and like this video. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.